Sega. In days long past, the Darksons, bringers of the Great Calamity, invaded Europa, pushing her to the brink of ruin. But the godly Valkyria heard the prayers of the people. Brandishing spears wreathed in blue flame, they struck down the Darkson invaders, ushering Europa into an era of peace. The year, 1935. Two powers stood poised for war. The East European Imperial Alliance, and in the West, the Atlantic Federation. Open conflict erupted as they vied for control of the continent. The Second European War had begun. Caught between giants, the small principality of Gallia. No small prize, Gallia possessed rich deposits of ragnite ore, a valuable energy source. The Imperial Alliance marched on Gallia, hoping to claim those resources for its own. The Empire conquered more than half of Gallia before the Gallian militia turned the tide and expelled the invaders. 
1937. Two years have passed since the Imperial Alliance invaded Gallia. But across the continent, the fires of war still rage. I'm looking for an Avon Hardens. Well, looks like you found him. What can I do for you? Dude and people. My name is Hubert Brixham. I instruct at the Lanseal Royal Military Academy. Hey, my brother Leon goes there. You'll confirm that this is your brother then? Yep, that's him all right. So, how's he doing? I realize this is sudden, and it pains me to be the bearer of sad tidings. But your brother, Leon Hardens, has passed away. Dead. What? I offer you my sincerest condolences. Hey, w wait, just a minute. Why is... How did he die? goes on at the Academy is classified for national security. <laughs> I'm afraid I cannot tell you any of the details surrounding his death. You can't tell me! That's messed up! I'm his family! Leon wouldn't... My brother can't be dead. Man, that's crazy! He was stronger than anybody I ever... What? That was nearby. Bad news, Ivan. We get rebels. They're attacking Malvir. Rebels? Now? Of all the times they could pick. Grab your guns, guys. We'll join the town guard and send them packing. Oh, okay. Just remember what we all learned back in training, and we'll be fine. Now let's go! Guys, these rebels are history. Listen up now. can actually win this fight in two turns. I've done it before. Problem is, this actually gives you one achievement less, so, um, yeah, I will not do that. Can basically do this. If I would be a little bit farther left, 
Like it would basically have to take one step back and one step left. So it could shoot this dude's head twice. And then pray that I hit this dude's head twice. Which worked last time I tried it first try, but um, yeah. As I said, you basically right. get one achievement less if you do that. Moving out. Enemy down. We sent them packing! <laughs> Phew. That should keep them out of Melvir for a while. A fine bit of leadership, gathering those men in the face of a surprise attack. Apparently, it's a family trait. Hey, you really won't tell me how my brother died. That is correct. It's classified information, I'm afraid. I guess that ends our conversation. You'll just have to let me into your academy then. What? You want to enroll? Leon can't be dead. My brother just wouldn't go down that easy. Period. I must beg to differ. This certificate of death indicates that he... Spare me the paperwork. I'm telling you, I don't buy it. Not until I see proof with my own eyes. Hmm. Then I suppose you'll be needing this. What is it? An application for new enrollment at Lanseal. I have to apply? Come on, you said you're a teacher! <laughs> As a non-scouted applicant, you'll face stricter standards for acceptance. If you still wish to apply, I won't stop you. All are at liberty to try. But if you think just anyone can get in, well, you'll learn soon enough. Now, if you'll excuse me, perhaps we'll meet again. Good day. Leon, it's just like you always said. If Galley is ever going to be at peace again, guys like us have to fight for it. Application for student enrollment? Fine, I'll pass your stupid test. And then there's going to be no stopping me. I'm coming for you, Leon. Seven. 
the Principality of Gallia. Still reeling from the recent invasion, Gallia now faces new troubles from within. Following the ceasefire between Gallia and the Imperial Alliance, a new Archduchess, Cordelia Guy Randbreeze, chooses to make public her Darkson heritage. Many respond favorably to her candor, but not all. United by their hatred of the Darksons, a group of nobles forms the Gallian Revolutionary Army. Commonly known as the Rebels, their campaign to purge Gallia of any Darkson influence soon earns them great favor in the South. The stage is set for the Gallian Civil War. Do it! Lanseal Royal Military Academy the oldest and most prestigious martial institution in all of Gallia. Here, cadets drill tirelessly yep. to live up to the standards set by those who have gone before. The school motto, never far from their thoughts. Victory through diligence, peace through strength. demented laugh will haunt me for at least a hundred hours now. It will follow me around. How oh, I not missed this at all. Like, I played this game before. This is one of the few games I played through on PSP. Mm -hmm. When did I get my PSPs? 2010? Question mark? 11? 12? I actually would have to, like, I, do, I actually do not remember when exactly. I would need to look at my save, save states. <clears throat> but yeah, the, wait, no, it was definitely before, before that. No, well, whatever. But, um, yeah. Uh, yeah. This game takes a while. Hmm. I actually kind of wished this series would have been one of the games where they released the game in, in the wrong order. And like, did achievements for the last one first. Because the third one is much, 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 much better than this one. <sighs> and the second one, you, you really feel that it, it's not really a main um, fire, fire emblem. Um, Valkyria Chronicles, you like. 
I don't really know what they called it, um, like, part two. It should have been, it kind of, it should have been a, um, um, off, you know, what is it called, like, a side game? I forgot. Oh god, I can't, can't remember the term, but you know what I mean, not, not a main title. <clears throat> A spin off not yeah, spin off is also wrong because this is just like the first one, like from game from the gameplay here. Well gameplay wise. I'll do it. But um Yeah, this game is just Hey! Is this seat taken? Uh very like All yours. it's much this game is much more um, visual hey, novel so, uh, my name's Yvonne. and less nice to meet you. game uh, than my the name's first Kazan and third Yvonne. one. It's really nice to meet you, and thanks for the seat. Hey, any time. Huh? It's I'm all so literally in a in high school, mind. so um, yeah, like half or like two thirds of the game Honestly. happen in a fucking high school. Kind of. In the third one, they just like the developer. Developers also just unlocked the pot potential of the of the um, PSP. Like it, the game just looks much, 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 much better, and also plays better. I'm Rodriguez, that's sir to you. I'm the proctor for your field exam. You will now form teams of three and participate in simulated combat. Answer when called. Cosette Colhearth. Yes, sir. Next is Zary. Yes, sir. Last up, Avon Hardens. Yo, sir. You are team A. Hey, we're on the same team, Avon. Let's give it our best shot. You bet. All set to go, Zeri. This dude sounds 
particularly familiar. But I just right now I can't remember who that is. I mean I mean the Proctor. I'm trying to picture it. Uh, it's it's on the tip of my tongue and and my brain. Um get Just my luck, I get the two of you dumped on me. Excuse me? You care to repeat that? Uh, hey guys, stop it! We should focus on the test now! Pipe down, maggots! If you're ready to begin, step forward! Who is that? Uh, who, like, literally, seriously, who is this? Or who, who am I thinking of? It's in some cartoon or maybe maybe an anime no, I, I think it's a cartoon uh. you won't be using live ammo here but a hit to the wrong spot can still kill this has to be the the, the, the this has to be the the um, same um, voice actor I just can't think of like it, it's in my brain. I just can't picture where I where I heard this before, and I've heard it a lot. I know that. Don't go drunk. This, this, this voice. It's not the exact same, but extremely similar. As if I've got plans, and none of them involve dying here. Oh, I'm all nervous. I hope this goes well. I really want to try this game, this same, this game out on my, on my Vita or one of one on one of my um, PSPs right now. Because to be honest, I cannot remember the sound being this. Um, what is it called? Um, not so pressed. Compressed. I did not remember it being this compressed. Maybe that, that's an emulation emu, emulation problem. Maybe. Like the S's are extremely his hissy. That usually happens due to compression. But I don't really remember this. And I do remember playing the game with kind of good um, earbuds. Yeah. Didn't hurt it back then, I think. Yeah, I don't know. It's like my brother used to say. Uh, oh yeah. Envision the self you wish to be, then take action to become him. We're gonna win this. In a landslide, for sure. Alright, let's go you two. Move out! Oh wait, I just remembered this game came out in 2010. When I got my PSP, that had to be 2010, 2011, or later. Yeah. Okay. Because this game was already out when I got mine. Zeri, Cosette, we're beating these guys and getting in! Listen up!
Watch and learn. Okay, let's go! Okay, let's go! Watch and learn. Thank you. 
I see you there. Okay, let's go! I see one! I see one! They've got to let us in after that. Yes! We did it! I have all three of you on Team A as having passed the written exam. It's Bender. It's fucking Bender. Guess that means you're in. Yay! I was so worried about the field exam, but we did it! It's because you guys helped push me along. No worries. <laughs> the field exam was the only part I wasn't worried about. Next is the aptitude screening, you two. I try not to dawdle. What aptitude are they screening? Nah, guess we'll find out soon enough. We're ready to screen you. Step through the gate, please. <clears throat> what is it? That blue glow is Ragnite, right? What does this thing tell you? I don't get it. 
I did it, Yvonne! I got placed as an engineer! Is that what you wanted? Yeah! I want to be a doctor someday. Wow, that's pretty impressive. Hmm, pretty impressive. You will always be the third best class. Hmm. What did you get, Zeri? I placed as a shock trooper. And you? Placed it as the worst class. I'm not really sure. They told me I could be any unit class I wanted. Oh, does that mean you have an aptitude for all of them? That's amazing! That, or an equal lack of aptitude for any of them. You jerk! You're gonna be like this all the time. Yes. Don't you two start again. We all just made it in. Let's try to get along. Yeah, I guess you're right. We're in this together. Got it, but I still fail and just <sighs> got a B rank. Woohoo! I came here with a purpose. I just I thought about. Are they really the worst class? Shock, shock troopers. Shock troopers are really bad until you get the last weapon. Or like the last, I, I don't remember, I think there was two? Or was there one? There is like one shock trooper weapon. I think it, it, that, that weapon exists in every single Vecuria Chronicles that has really good accuracy. But before you get that thing... I don't remember yet, maybe even the last normal um, one was good. Uh, actually no 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 it was you you get a really accurate accurate um shock trooper weapon from an from an enemy ace actually you get two of them i don't remember how how you got this the second one uh, the, i think there's pretty much always two of them or at least in the first, uh, in the second and the third game, there is two of them. And as soon as you get that thing, dog troopers become extremely overpowered. But before that, they're basically just there to run at people and spray and pray. Literally all they do. They run at people and draw their attention. They are basically the tanks of this game. You basically just draw the fire and then you get in with your actual like good units, usually the scouts. You just get in with the scouts and shoot the enemies in the head from behind. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, it's the Scouts are just really overpowered in these games, like they are massively overpowered. The only unit that's kind of better-ish um, are the snipers, or at least I love them, because uh, they are not that super good in the early game, but after like five, six, seven missions in the like early mid game, they become extremely extremely overpowered because their accuracy just yeah the accuracy just goes completely insane on them it becomes extremely extremely ridiculous also the damage of course and i'll tell you now it isn't to pal around with clowns like you but the problem is they don't have a lot of movement which scouts do have and in the late game like in the last third of the game scouts are almost as accurate as well not almost as accurate but they are extremely accurate like it doesn't come close to sh to sh um, snipers because in the late game snipers with the correct weapon basically shoot at like five pixels or something like that like it's ridiculous how small their um their aim thingy is <clears throat> but scouts are much 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 more more um 
um, accurate than snipers when you first get them. Which is ridiculous. I'm going to the headmaster's office now for my class placement. Basically, snipers are just completely overkill. Like, their accuracy is completely complete overkill. And scouts are not that much worse accuracy-wise. But they can move, like, twice the amount of, like, distance. Also, they are tankier. What's that kid's problem? They have more life Things and so eat less damage, I think. Or maybe, actually, no, that's actually, I think mm -hmm. I just lied. They, they, um, get... The, the damage they get, the damage, the damage they take is the same. But still, scouts are massively overpowered in the late game. And mid game. Um, I kind of doubt it's because of his glasses. Ooh, but I should head off now too. I'll see you later, Avon. And engineers are basically just war scouts, for the most part. But you always want at least one in your team, because they can re well, they can um, reload your or they can give your um, units more ammo. They repair. Um, I don't want to spoil anything, but they repair machines. And, um, they can heal people. Alright, next stop, the Headmaster's office. Maybe I can get some info about Leon out of him while I'm there. It's worth a try, at least. Sir, I just passed the entrance exam. Ah, congratulations. Let me be the first to welcome you to Lancio. I am the headmaster here, Lawrence Clivehart. It's nice to meet you, Avan. Hmm. It seems your exam results place you in Class G. I hope you'll make the most of your time here at Lancio, my boy. Um... Is there something else, son? I wanted to ask you about my brother, Leon Hardens. Leon was your... I see. Leon was just a student here. How could he just go and die? Your brother was a student of great promise and a true patriot. He stood out amongst his peers and in intelligence, strength and leadership. I'm afraid national security concerns prevent me from giving details. But just before his death, he was appointed to a special mission. A special mission? That's right, I remember it from Leon's letter. I've been selected for a special mission. It's an honor and an opportunity. That was his last letter. The next I heard was from that Brixham guy. As I imagine you know, this is Gallia's only military academy, Ivan. The students here study and train tirelessly to keep their nation safe. That was Leon's aim in accepting the mission that cost him his life as well. Sadly, that is all I can tell you. That and that your arrival here... Well, I feel Leon's hand is guiding you to us. Maudlin, as it sounds. Hmm. Galia's people are living in fear and anguish in the face of rebel atrocities. I pray you will grow to become a powerful force for justice, Aban. Yes, sir. I'll do my best.
<laughs> there it is. Stop. Please. Try to get close. A little too close. Put in class G. Oh no. What? Oh, of course I had to be placed with you. Oh wow! Yay! I'm in class G too! All three of us are together! There's no class G too. Stop lying, Gazette! such as yourselves. <laughs> Whoa, is that coming from the classroom? You fucking failures! Mm. Even worse I than F's. Yourselves. Me? I'm Yvonne Hardens. I'm in Class G, starting today. If I remember correctly, you're a good scout. Your class is a sort of landfill for those with abysmal entrance scores. Hey, what's your deal? It's the unalloyed truth. <laughs> you haven't even produced a class chair. Your sustained presence at this academy shames me. You stain Lanciel's name. Put it to you, Rejects. Is there not a single volunteer for a class chair? Uh, um. Hmm. 
not a one. You see? Just as I said, Class G is a... Here! Huh? Oh, no. What, me? Wait a second. What are you doing? <laughs> but something like this happened to me in school. Like, I put myself, um... On... Well... The voting, or into the, the votings for class chair as a joke. And I won. And, uh, yeah. Fuck. What? Oh, oh my! What am I doing? I just got so angry listening to her talk, my hand just shot up! With Your my hand, hand in it? <laughs> huh. Ridiculous. It's painfully obvious that you don't have what it takes. What? What's your problem? Talking down to everybody like you own the place. You want a class chair? Fine, I'll do it. Please. You're barely fit to follow, let alone lead. That takes an elite. What a tiresome word. There are few things more pathetic than the pedigree of a self-styled elite. You, you impertinent beast! A darksin! Presuming to mock me! I'll have your... What's going on here? Even you lot don't usually make this much noise. Brixham! Juliana, is there a reason you've chosen to visit us today? Professor Brixham, I was just on my way. All right, let's begin today's lesson, shall we? <laughs> Listen up now. Do it!
To begin, here is today's news. I really do not remember what way of like spending or XP was better. And now that I say that, I think I'm stupid because um, XP was for classes and money was for the equipment. Yeah. get it but I'm pretty sure this um looks pervy um by accident right like I'm trying to to think about what this is supposed to mean but newcomer God, uh, I uh, whatever. Oh, I think that the the one on the bottom right, she gets weak. She isn't alone. She has a a passive ability that makes her weaker when she is around people. That's actually a thing a lot of the characters have. Or when they are not good around, like, their own or the other um, gender. Or sex. <clears throat> or sex. Whatever you want to call it. You know what I mean. Yeah. Roger! Oh no, I just remembered her. She's actually, like... Well, not important, but she has, um, 
like story wise she does more than like it's actually important that she's a um it's news hunter <laughs> Troopers. Hey! Hello? <laughs> Thanks. Are you free? The rocket launcher people? Oh, yeah, they are the rocket launcher people, I think. or at least I never actually use them for that like you're kind of supposed to use them as actual like he even said it you're supposed to use them as the tanks but you don't like I never did the um, shock trooper the shock troopers are, are just much better at doing this the only time where they are actually better at doing this is if I remember correctly um, when you're trying to pass a tank, a, a tank's front, that's pretty much it. They are wait the the lancers are the um. No, I'm could oh no wait, the other people were actually the tank people. Yeah, spoiler. Uh, they are the like machine people. that I said that oh god I'm so confused they can get rid of stuff like disarm traps wait I'm so fucking confused
Hmm. A word, please. <laughs> yeah, no, I I kind of start. I'm starting to remember what the um tank. The, no, I don't understand why they called themselves the tanks of the unit. Because I remember, I think I finally remember what they were. These are. They are basically the same as, um, engineers. But they repair stuff. And the engineers heal. I think the engineers in this game, I, I don't know if it's in general or in just in this game. But the engineers do not repair machines. They just heal. And there is these, well, the other dudes that I'm just completely confused about right now and they um well they do the same I think they have the same weapon the scout weapon and they are equally as bad with them yeah I think that's what it was Listen up now. they can repair. God, I completely forgot this unit. I 
don't remember if these units even exist in any other game. I don't think so. Maybe in the third one? But I'm pretty sure they do not exist in the first. Fourth? Well, in the first and fourth one. I do not remember if they, if they are in the third one, but... Yeah, they're really unique. And to be honest, I don't remember if they were really that good. Probably not, ah, to be honest. Ahmad, how can I help you today? Um, oh yeah, I forgot about this. Don't remember. Uh, I think in this game there um, does exist bonding, like in Fire Emblem. You basically have to, you have to let certain characters do missions together to um, level up their bonds. That actually makes them better. Let's show them what we got, guys! Listen up! Understood. 
I'll take point. Enemy sighted. You picked the wrong fight. Moving out. Nothing to get riled about. feel great. Easy. Sorry. Moving out. Nothing to get wild about. I feel amazing. It feels amazing. Yes. All right, we got the target.
don't remember what any of this means. Um, yeah. To begin, here is today's news. Nice.
Listen up. I've been waiting. You've done well, men. That's another level. Uh. I need to take a nap. I'm really... Uh, I'm not feeling well. Um... Yeah. Bye-bye. I already saved, right? Yeah, I did. Whatever. Do it again. <laughs>